Hello, I'm Dr. Robert Fennell with handandfootpain.com and today I'm going to show you how to use grippers. A gripper is an instrument or tool that's used to increase grip strength in your hand. Now let's talk about some of the conditions you may be suffering with that you might want to rehabilitate with grippers. Well, before I get into that, realize that a gripper is not a corrective tool, it's a strengthening and a rehabilitative tool, which means if you suffer some, from some of the conditions such as carpal tunnel syndrome, uh, nerve entrapments in the wrist and hand, sprains and strains of the wrist and hand, elbow problems, these conditions and syndromes are usually the result of repetitive stress and strain to the joints and muscles and ligaments of the hand, elbow, and the wrist. If you have those conditions, probably you have some small misalignments and weaknesses with these ligamentous structures. You want to make sure you get properly diagnosed and treat before you start the rehabilitation process using your grippers. Now, as a chiropractor, I've treated thousands of patients successfully by doing chiropractic manipulation and adjustments on the wrist and hand bones and the elbow area. This is very beneficial for a lot of these conditions that people suffer with in those areas. Let's talk about how to use the gripper now to strengthen and rehabilitate the small muscles in your hand, wrist, and forearm area. Well, you're going to hold the gripper just like this, and one of the biggest mistakes is people start using this very quickly. You don't want to go fast because that can cause or precipitate more injuries in the wrist, hand, and small muscles. You want to use very slow and controlled motions. I like to use a six-second repetition or cycle. So let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six. Notice I went three seconds in to both handles touched, and then three seconds back out. You never want to go too fast. In fact, if you went longer than three in and three out, that's fine. You can't go too slow. Do that for 10 repetitions. Do both hands so you can give the opposite hand a rest, and you can do two sets of that on each side. Now, we're going to switch the grippers around backwards and hold it this direction. So, the first way, the thumbs were close to the spring on the gripper. This way, the thumbs are closer to the ends of the handle. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. Again, for repetition of 10 times on both hands, you can do two sets. That works the musculature in a little bit different fashion. This is Dr. Robert Fennell with handandfootpain.com, and I want to thank you for watching this video today on how to use a gripper.